Finally, we're at the BBL. We are, and the sun's actually out for once, which is. They said there was going to be rain and thunderstorms, and that's the current current skyline of the Melbourne CBD at 5 5 30, 6 p.m. Tell you what, bloody day for it. It's a very good day for cricket as long as it stays like that. Yeah, no, nah, it's good to watch. Uh, good to watch cricket at the home of sport, the home of cricket, uh, the G, G banger. G banger. G banger. He's ripped out the G banger in the intro. I don't mind. <laughs> You really spent a whole day um, dealing with budgie smuggler with the, uh, the underwear, so that's where you got the G-Banger from? Or? Yeah, G-Banger, it's a little bit hot, I'm starting to, f uh, yeah. Are you wearing one right now? No. <laughs> we got Andy Munro, Jared Davis, Kados has come along, and the Stars are going to win. Their first game. Sure. I don't know. <laughs> first time in about five years. Yeah. Hey, on roaming guys. Hello, our yeah, big fella. We've got a T10 match. Uh, 15 now, 15. I've 15. changed. 15. I made sure to change. Oh, the team had extra overs, have not it? Oh, Five yeah. extra overs. It's going to be a five day test by the time <laughs> we get there. <laughs> So a 15-15 game, um, are you confident about the side you picked? Well, you just look at the list, it's, it's clear which team is going to win. Um, you've got a you've got confident. an A-grade cricketer in uh, DJ Checkers, you've got a, a league-spinning master in Kane McDonald, yep. and you've got a you've got a full-time number 11 in me. Oh, mate, you're the opener, you're the opener on Monday. Here we go. Uh, you ready for that. Yeah, well, I did make six of eight the other night, so uh, I'm ready for the promotion. Get into him. There's been a bit of been a bit of beef out on the way in the field, but but back to the game. Um, who who do you reckon is going to shine for for your team on Monday? Um, well, honestly, I'm hoping you stand out because I don't think it's been a while since you've gotten a good bat. You don't usually get a good bat with the uh, Richmond City team, so it's I think true. I think you deserve. It. Uh, a, a bigger opportunity because you do have a great technique. Oh, thank so I, think, you. I think you will shine, get us off to a beautiful good start. Maybe 20 off 20, I'm hoping for. Just knock it around, get those singles, that's what I'm looking for, and then start going over the top. If Cardman's bowling those pies I saw in the last game that he played, he's, he's done, he's done. Gonna uh, freeze up the Perth Scorchers bowling attack. That's a good one. We all came that in. Just a bit of a collapse. Not many people went on with the big scores. Uh, Liam Dawson on 22. He's there with Harris Ralph, just trying to trying to hold up an end a bit. And Harris Ralph has just hit it to a fields when it wants to run. Defendable. If you bowl well, you bowl to your field, it's defendable. But if you let the reigning premiers get away, it's going to be tough. It's going to be tough. A young Melbourne Stars side, an inexperienced Melbourne Stars side. See how it goes. By the man Jesse James. Getting real uh, Lammy's vibes about this one. It's a pretty cool. Hey mate, how are you? Good thanks, mate. That's the way.
Club. What's the cricket club? Warwick. Toads. The Toads. The Toads. Yeah. Love the Toadies. Love that. Good team. Go the Toads. Legends, 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 legends. All of you. Come on, let's get a photo. Righto, they've taken one upstairs here. Will be an interesting one. It's out. I'm saying it's out. Who the fuck is good? I'm fine. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's got his foot back in the crease. Very smart, very smart. But good keeping from Sam Harper still. Seven wickets, pretty convincingly. Oh, it's a uh, painful, painful for Stars fans. All right, we're here with Campbell Callaway. Can you hold this one? So we got Campbell reacting to Jerry Davis's dismissal last night. He thinks it wasn't out, but we'll let Campbell be the judge. Out from Deet Square. 100%. Oh, oh, come on. See you, mate. <laughs> Appreciate it. Thank you, Campbell. No, he's, no, I'm taking him off my box. He's, he's no longer on my box. He's been cut. We're here with Hilton Cartwright. Hilton, we're ninth grade cricketers. Obviously, you uh, A grade cricketers out on the, uh, on the G. Who do you reckon would fit in mostly with the ninth grade cricketers from the Melbourne Stars? I think it's going to have to be Sam Harper. He's, yeah. um, he loves cricket too much to give it up, and I reckon he's the sort of guy that will always give 100% no matter if he's going well or badly. Um, and he just, he'll just play to the 65 or a fifth and he'll probably play ninth grade like that. Something about that because he goes to the same cafe that we do five times a week. <laughs>